Welcome to this QuickBooks Online tutorial for Beginners 2019 on how to pay bills by credit card. Uh, so we're in QuickBooks Online here, and uh, sometimes when you pay bills, you know, so you go through the process, you enter bills, uh, you pay bills, and it's not always out of your checking account, okay? So you may pay a bill by a credit card, and it happens all the time. So I want to show you how to record that in QuickBooks. So you're going to enter your bill just like normal, okay? So you go through the, the enter the bills uh, function. Now, to be able to pay the bill by a credit card, you have to set up the credit card in QuickBooks Online, okay? And it's it's just in your chart of accounts. So let me go over here and show you. Okay, so if I go to my chart of accounts, okay, uh, you're going to have to set up your credit card in your chart of accounts. Now, if you've been using your credit card in QuickBooks Online and um, you know, you, you've set up the bank feed, et cetera, it's already gonna be in here, all right? But if this is your first time, you're gonna have to set this up and I highly recommend that you set up the bank feed as well for your credit card. Okay, so you can see here, we have a MasterCard set up. There's a Visa also. The MasterCard is, uh, has the bank feed set up. You can tell by this, these arrows here and the Visa does not, okay? So once you set up the credit cards in your chart of accounts, and again, you just you should do this uh, just for your proper accounting anyway, then it will allow you to use it as a payment method. All right. So what we're going to do, we're going to go over here and we're going to say pay bills. So you'll see here uh, we have our bills that show up that we need to pay and the payment account. OK, so we can say we can choose that and you'll see here are the two credit cards that are set up in the chart of accounts. And then we have our checking and our savings. All right, so it defaulted to the MasterCard. So let's say that we're going to use the MasterCard to pay this bill. All right, so we're going to say we're going to pay Diego's Road Warrior Body Shop $755 on the credit card. All right, so we just check it off. We make sure that says uh, MasterCard and we go down here and you can save and close or save it. Okay, and let's hit save and close. So that's how you pay a bill by credit card. It's pretty straightforward. OK, now some people, you know, do various things within QuickBooks, and this is the proper way to do it so that you keep everything straight. Now, what I do want to show you, though, is in your bank feeds. All right. So if I go over to banking, because what's going to happen is you, you will if you set up your bank feeds for the credit card and you pay a bill by credit card, it's going to come in through your bank feed. All right. Now, it should match the transaction. OK, so as you can see here where it says Norton Lumber and Building Materials, bill payment, okay? And this is on the MasterCard account, all right? So it should match up. Now, obviously, it's not going to show the $755 I just did because uh, this is a sample file and there's uh, it didn't come through on the bank feed. Okay, but uh, it'll come through on the bank feed and you have to make sure it matches up. Now, it should do it automatically, but this is something you need to double check, okay? So that's basically it. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, you just want to make sure that you follow the process of how to do it in QuickBooks Online. Uh, just like, uh, you know, all the various ways to do things in QuickBooks Online, you want to make sure you follow those processes. All right. Uh, head on over to the QuickBooks University. Love to help you out over there. We help uh, many, many, many business owners as well as bookkeepers and accountants uh, learn QuickBooks and uh, make sure they do everything right in their QuickBooks file. Head over there now, qbuniversity.org.